What's up, YouTube? It's Andrew Pro, and today I got a great video for you guys. It's another Android app review, and this is gonna be um, over screen. Um, I don't know if there's a difference between the paid or between this version and the actual one because I didn't actually pay for this. I hacked it just so I could try it out, and it's pretty cool. I might actually buy it. it seems legit. Um, so, okay, this it looks like it's a browser, but what's interesting about this browser or this app is that you could do this. You basically can make your phone into a, into a, into a computer. Basically, the only thing that kind of makes it bad is that you know you can't really run apps in this. It's kind of just like Windows of browsers. But you know, I don't really care about that. And you can actually, you can, I don't know, minimize minimize it. Makes it go to the status bar. Min, yeah, minimize and you click it, and it's back. Uh, I think this is the four dollars in the App Store or the Play Store. You can go ahead and resize it. Probably better in the actual version, and you can go ahead and click this middle button right here to make it a uh, full screen or yeah, full screen. I think it turns to to the side. I'm not quite sure. I think it does. Just kind of glitching out. Um, you go ahead and close the window like that, and if you just want to open it, just like if you're clicking the browser, or if you're opening a link, it'll probably yeah, it'll ask you to if you want to open the over screen. But I think it's kind of cool because that way you don't have to go back. Um, out of the app that you're in app, once you open this So that way, like if you're if you're like on Engadget, let's see if you're on Engadget. Let's go to Engadget You're on Engadget, and of course you click something after you uh, So there you can turn you can turn it off right there if you click terminate I click this app store It will probably give me a link. Let's see Now if I click official blog there we go click over screen and look at that, it is its own little thing right here, it's loading up. Look at that, it's resizable, you can scroll in it, everything, zoom in, all of this. This is just simply amazing little app. Uh, you can go ahead and do a bunch of little things over here, forward, back, home, fresh. Settings are right here, which is pretty cool. You can have multiple windows too. I believe it actually opens, nope, I think it stays in the same, oh yeah, you could, that's quite cool. I didn't notice that before. You could actually scroll through like that. You could scroll through your windows like that. That's pretty cool. Yes, yeah, that's pretty cool. And you can click on it and it'll go to that. Click on it, go to that. Let's see. Click on it. Yep, it'll go to that. Settings. Uh, desktop version. That's pretty nice. That helps out a lot. You don't want those stupid small mobile pages. Let's go ahead and enlarge this. Click that. Settings, bookmarks, regular. Um, yeah, all your basic browser settings that come with the Android browser usually. Yeah, I hope you guys go check out this app. It's cool. It's pretty useful if you're, if you're um, what is it called? If you're like one to use the internet a lot and you don't want to leave the app when you do something or like you're clicking a link, which I think is quite useful. Yeah, um, I hope you guys like the intro that I just made. Pretty cool, I guess. Took me a while to make. Um, tell me you guys like it. There's something wrong with it. Or you want to change it? Go ahead and tell me and I'll think about it. Alright, thanks for watching. Subscribe.